RF is go. T1. T1 is go. GC. GC is go. The LS. The LS is go. In five, four, three, two, <laughs> one. And there goes Electron for our 15th launch from Rocket Lab Launch Complex 1 in New Zealand. We're T plus 50 seconds and Electron is approaching max Q, or maximum aerodynamic pressure. The moment during its ascent when the forces Everyone. against the vehicle are at their strongest. Clear at maximum dynamic pressure. Enter Chevron 2. Clear at maximum dynamic pressure. Next up will be three events in quick succession. We should hear the call for Miko as Electron's Rutherford engines throttle down to allow for stage separation before the engine on the second stage fires up to continue the mission to orbit. Successful Miko confirmed by Mission Control. Soon the fairing halves will separate and you'll be able to watch them fall away confirmed. on your screen there. Stage two ignition confirmed. And there they go, Electron has successfully jettisoned the fairing and is continuing nominally towards orbit. With the vehicle now travelling at several thousand kilometres an hour. In the next minute and a half or so, Electron's second stage Rutherford engine will power down before shutting off. We call this SECO, which stands for Second Engine Cutoff, and this allows for a clean separation of the kick stage. Then, the kick stage will light its Curie engine and continue on its trajectory, coasting for a time before relighting its engine to carry the satellites closer to their optimal position orbiting Earth. We'll be ending the broadcast shortly after we hear the confirmation of successful SECO and stage separation. Electron's second stage engine continues to it's propel the payloads towards their targeted orbit. He entered stage two burnout detect mode. Guidance is in terminal, 20 seconds remaining. And SECO confirmed. You can see the engine on stage 2 has separation shut down. Confirms. We're now waiting for kick stage separation. HVB, battery discharge holding on all. We've just had confirmation that the kick stage has separated. With another 40 minutes or so until that final carry engine relights, we're going to end the launch broadcast here ahead of payload deployment. We'll share the news of mission success on our Rocket Lab social media channels within the next hour. Thank you to our SmallSat customers, Planet and Canon Electronics, for choosing to launch on Electron today. I'm Ariana Ryan. I'm Dominic Vu. This is Rocket Lab Mission Control, signing off.